All right, so here we have a mirror matchup and we are going first. Katakuri against Katakuri and we will more, ugh, even though we have the press pro and the big mom. And you know what, no, we'll keep, we'll keep. We don't need our first turn. So we have the press pro, we have the roundup and we have the uh, send cost big mom. So I think that's more than enough to justify keeping this hand. And we have a 2k counter and a blocker. So yeah, it would be crazy not to keep. I almost mulliganed, thinking that we could have gotten something better, but I don't think we'll get anything better here. So he's probably gonna do the same thing. He's gonna drop the Pearl Sparrow, which is fine. And yeah, we'll take. We have a Sanji, which we will play by discarding a Sanji. Yeah, Sanji for a Sanji, it's not a bad deal. And we have the pudding that will help us get something better afterwards. So here, simply gonna just attack. And honestly, might as well just attack with everything. Let's get rid of everything and play the Randolph, make him discard cards, be very aggressive. Since we already have next turn, Descent cost Big Mom and like three bodies on the field. So here he's attacking for eight, uh, for six. So that was a mistake on his part. So we'll make him uh, re-attack with Sanji. So it's just a, we'll re-attack with the character. It's just so that he focuses on our, on our board instead of our life. But he does have the uh, cracker here, which is a little bit unfortunate, but that's fine really. Because we will try to get an additional. Uh... Here I'm debating to see whether or not it's worth it to put the. Uh, to give him a press pearl, but I think, yeah, let's just control the board, let him get something. You know, if we're lucky enough, he's gonna whiff. But uh, he got the, a press pearl. Yeah, he got a press pearl. That's not gonna do anything for him. And now we're just gonna attack for five. We'll make him discard cards. And here, I think we're gonna have to discard two of our cards to be able to counter the cracker. And he decides to trash, all right. So that's good, that's good. So here's attacking for, for seven with double attack. We're not gonna take that. And we're just gonna block. And here he's attacking for five, which is fine. And we get another pudding. And he gets a big mom. And here I will grant him. Uh, yeah, we will grant him a life because we're gonna get a, a life trashed, right? So we have the big mom here. So now what we're looking for is the Peril Sparrow. So, and it's a good thing that we gave him a life so that way the cracker did not get the 1000 attack. So here, I'm really, really hoping to get getting the uh, the um, what should I call it? The Katakuri. And we got the Katakuri, so we will take that, and then we will return the cards. So we have the Katakuri here, so we will just attack with everything that we have, apply as much pressure as we can, and then force him. To this to take as much life as we can and he got a ooh, he got a cracker that is very bad for us but we will we will bottom life is big mom and then our turn now we have a big board so even if he drops the five cost at uh, the ten cost big mom uh, we're more than fine and if he doesn't at this point then he's just losing the game. All right, so now he's attacking Pearl Sparrow, which is fine. Uh, with the Pearl Sparrow, we will take the Pudding. And then, then, yeah, so he gets the Big Mom here. And honestly, at this point, we are just going to drop our Big Mom ourselves. But we will get rid of the Cracker. We'll get rid of his board. And here we have a decision to make, but let's just take the unknown card and it was another big mob so that is very good we took a very good card out of the game and here i think like we have the advantage 
So even though we started first, we were able to regain the advantage because we had the perfect curve of Perro Sparrow, Randolph, Big Mom, Katakuri, and Big Mom. Like, this is a very, very strong, um, very strong board to have, a very strong ramp to have. And here, honestly, I'm just gonna, just gonna counter for one. And if he decides to clear something, be my guest. Like, okay, even if I didn't discard anything, oh, and we drew the 10 cost big mom. All right, no, that's just GG. So now we're just attacking for 12. Yeah, that is GG. And yeah, that's it for this match, mirror matchup, Katakuri against Katakuri. We did pretty well, it was a fast game, a little quick one for the day. And as a reminder, here is my deck list. And I also have a video uh, explaining my choices for the deck. So make sure to go check that out. And yeah, make sure to subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Leave a like if you are enjoying the category content. And let me know in the comments below, what are the modifications that you would do to the deck? I feel very, very comfortable with the list that I have right now. I feel it's very flexible and leaves a lot of room for uh, different types of play. It can either be super aggressive, very defensive. So yeah, let me know in the comments. All right, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.